Today, we're going to talk about the pros and cons of the smallest town in Rhode Island, North Providence. So if you've ever wondered about what it's like to work and live here, stay tuned. Hi, I'm Carl Passarelli, native Rhode Islander and local realtor with Home Smart Professionals. And on this channel, we talk about real estate and all things Rhode Island. Let's get started with the pros. North Providence has some top rated schools. There are eight public schools located throughout the town. Five are elementary schools, two are middle schools, and there's one high school. Two of the public schools also offer a pre-K as well as 15 other private facilities. Additionally, the town is home to one private school for grades 2 through 12. Moving on to shopping and restaurants, North Providence is bisected by its main thoroughfare, Middle Spring Avenue, where you'll find a variety of conveniences from bakeries, grocery stores, gas stations, home improvement stores, coffee shops, and restaurants. Some of the restaurants you'll find in town are the legendary Twins Pizza, which has been a dining hotspot for over 50 years. Pauli Penta's Italian Deli has been serving up fresh, on-site prepared deli and specialty items for almost 25 years. Also located on Middle Spring Avenue is Providence Bagel, where you can enjoy their famous Nitro Cold Brew to go with your fresh baked bagel. And located on Smith Street, another main thoroughfare in North Providence, is the award-winning Cool Licks Creamery, a must-stop in summer for all things ice cream, including non-dairy Dole Whip, and even a special ice cream treat for your beloved furry friends. The town has a few recreational parks, Captain Stephen Only Park and Governor Nadi Memorial Park. Stephen Only Park is small, but very well kept, with a short paved walking trail, as well as a playground, picnic tables, tennis courts, a basketball court, and softball field. Governor Nadi Memorial Park is larger and offers a full recreational facility, including tennis courts, picnic sites, a shaded playground area, and baseball field, parking, a paved walking path, and freshwater beach with paddle boat rentals. Governor Nadi Park is also the location of the Overlook at Meehan. This recently renovated event facility offers a panoramic view of Wenscott Reservoir and has seating for up to 120 guests. The Overlook also has an outdoor gazebo and is available for rent for weddings and special events. For golf lovers, North Providence is also home to Lewis Gwizzett Golf Club, where the residence line course is carved through rolling hills, natural wetlands, and numerous oak trees. Golf enthusiasts will love it. One of the town's best kept secrets is the North Providence Pool and Fitness Center, which is a town-owned fitness facility with a weight room and aerobics machines. They also offer yoga and other exercise classes. The center has a whirlpool with seating for 12, two saunas, and a six lane 25 meter heated indoor swimming pool that offers swimming classes and water aerobics. Discounted memberships are available to town residents, children, seniors, veterans, and military personnel. I've provided a link below. Another pro, North Providence offers homestead exemptions for homeowners, including tax discounts for military, veterans, and seniors. For more detailed information, please view the link below. Now on to the cons, traffic. As the case with many towns in Rhode Island, increased development and a swell in population brings with it additional traffic. During business hours, Mineral Spring Avenue, which is one of the main thoroughfares in town, can be quite difficult to navigate. This is why it is locally known as Miserable Spring Avenue. And no Rhode Island cons list is complete without talking about high taxes. Though there are exemptions and discounts available, North Providence has high property taxes, ranking seventh highest out of Rhode Island's 39 towns. The last con we'll discuss is increasing urban environment. Due to the increased development and swelling population, North Providence is taking on more of an urban feel. There are more stores and businesses which increase travel to and from in and around the town, which gives it a busier vibe. With a median home price of $340,000, North Providence offers a variety of housing options from condominiums to townhouses single-family homes and rentals. North Providence is a family-oriented town 
and a very nice place to live and work. If you would like to learn more about North Providence, please check out my next video where we tour the neighborhood of Lee's Farm. Thank you for watching and I'll see you at the next video.